Hi everybody, welcome back to another food review on one channel. My name is Nick Manzoni. Thank you so much for joining me tonight, folks. Well, folks, good evening. It is Thursday night, July 6th, 2023, and I want to welcome you to another food review. If, um, if you watched the last food review, you know that I was kind of on the spicy kick, and I'm, boy, am I excited to try this tonight because this is not spicy at all, and I'm relieved and very, very excited to try this. What are they? Well, like a slime, huh? <laughs> these are the Lay's Wavy, and these are the Hickory Barbecue flavor, and I'm, like I said, I'm very excited to try these. I hope these are good. I have no prediction on these, only because these are new to me, so... I tell you what, I'm not going to waste your time, we're just going to uh, get right into it and review these and at the end I will talk for a little bit. I, I, won't, I won't bore you, I promise. So, at first glance, the smell, actually the back looks pretty, pretty basic. See, so I can show you. And again, um, I don't know if you caught my last slaves review. I love buffalo chicken sandwich, but the only issue I have with the leaves is you don't get as many as, like, say, Doritos or, or like, the Ruffles or anything else. That's my only complaint about the, uh, the bag so far, but I'm not going to read any the bag. I'm just going to tell you how it tastes, so let's dump some up. So, let's look at the chip. You can see the wavy shape, which, okay. Um, will these taste like barbecue leaves? <sighs> Probably, but let's see how they taste. Let's go, let's go and blend. These are the wavy leaves, hickory barbecue flavor. Let's go. You know what? That's <laughs> that's a very, very, very tame flavor. Do I on the back of the bag it says saucy and smoky. Um I'm getting smoky on the on kind of the back the back edge of it. The saucy, not so much, and I believe it's because of the the powder on the chip. The first one I took it wasn't enough powder. So let's see this one. I think there's enough powder in here? Let's see. Mm-hmm. These are as basic as you can get, as tame. They're not spicy, so that's that's a good thing. The hallelujah, that's a good thing. <laughs> um, this is more red. This has more powder, so let's see about this. Mm. Mm. They're good. They're real good. Um... They're definitely a nice step back from the spicy and the heat of Doritos, um, but let's see this one. Hopefully, this one's better with the sm with the with the smokiness. Mhm. Mm yes. See, I'm gonna try to explain to you. My palm with chips and just leaves in general. And the Doritos, they don't seem to have this palm, so it's kind of weird. Um, on, on these chips, the equalness of distribution or 
if that's even a sentence, I don't even know. Um, the distribution on a chip is um, enough to be desired. Uh, what I mean by that is you don't get enough flavor in every chip. And, you know, you take your first chip and you're like, okay, I get the flavor. You take your second chip, same thing. By, when you get to the first chip, you're like, okay, the flavor is gone. So you're just eating a basic potato chip. That's the problem here. The, the distribution of the flavor is not there. So I took my first chip, it was basic. The second chip I took was delicious. Let's see this. See, that's even better. Um, I don't know how to fix that per se because you're trying to get a balance, but you can't. Um, I guess there's no way to fix that, but these are, if you want a nice break, a nice relief from spicy and tangy and sweet chili, go with these. These are a step down, but these are real good. Mm -hmm. Let's take one more for a while. Mm -hmm. For my opinion, I say we're good. On the scale of 1 to 10, with 1 being awful and 10 being awesome, I'm going to give the Wavy Leaves. The hickory barbecue. Do I taste any hickory? I definitely taste the sauce. The sauce is kind of at the back edge of the chip. Smoky? Yeah, a little bit. Not not much. It's not like, oh my god, it's so smoky, but you taste it. So, I, I'm going to give these a 7 out of 10. I think I think a 6 is too low and a five, 5 might be way low and an 8 might be too high. So 7 works for me. It's very tame. It's a relief from the heat, from the spiciness. And you won't be grabbing a bottle of water afterwards. You'll be, going, you'll be saying, oh, okay, these, this works. It's, it's acceptable for what it is. Um, can you eat 27 of these? Of course you can, because these are, these are very good. Um, and I think you will not be disappointed if you pick up a bag of these up, or if you pick, if you go with any, any non-heat ones. But my next review, or kind of my next review, we, we're going to go back to spicy, which is a new flavor I haven't tried, tried before, so... I wanted to do this first because this is my break, and then in the next video we're going to go back to uh, spicy and hopefully that's very really good because I'm excited about that one too. So this gets a 7 out of 10. Go to your local uh, grocery store, pick a, a bag up of these. You will not be disappointed, I promise you that. Um, I just wanted to mention uh, one thing before I go. Um, in a future video, I want want to I want to do Mr. Beast Burger. I know um, there is a um, re restaurant close by here, um, so not next video, but possibly the video after. I'm gonna attempt to do Mr. Beast Burger because I've heard that's pretty good, and I've never done that, and I'm I'm real excited to try that, and I hope 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 that's a great video because. Oh, that may that may be a that may be a long video depending on what I get depending on what the menu is. I have not looked at the menu. I don't know what's on it, so we'll see when we get there. But stay tuned for that. That's that's going to be exciting, and there's going to be more exciting stuff to come. We got to do food and wine. We got to do. Uh, we got to get back to fast food. Hopefully, uh, <laughs> within within the coming weeks, I'll claim my stomach to go back to fast food. Uh, but yeah, get excited for that. There's plenty more to come and 
there'll be more more food news, more Disney content, more game stuff too, if you like that. But if if you want, just leave a comment in the section below. Tell me what you want me to see next. I got a lot of good comments on my last video, a lot of good ideas. So I'm mean, I'm gonna sift through that and see what we can come up with. But that's it. That's the review. Thank you for watching. You guys are the best fans in the world. Please like, share, and subscribe to all my videos. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, this is Nick Mandarin signing off. I hope you have a good night, and I'll see you soon. Take care.